Hello YouTubers, friends, subscribers, JW Solar USA. Well, today is the final update or upgrade on the 10th Kyocera's 120 up at Tom's place. And it's gonna be running, will be running pretty soon. And this is what we're doing right now, attaching the uh, the bolt and U bolt or whatever supposed to be holding that thing and uh, and we are ready for business making power so um, if you do the math here if we do the math here is a hundred and twenty watt times ten so it's supposed to give them 1.2 kilowatts of power we are ready for business and we're ready for the winter. JW Solar USA, stay tuned for more videos. And the sun is coming right up there. And we will be ready for business, making some power and sits right there back of the trees all right folks this is the the way we attach the system the panels right here this you can buy these are u-bolts so you can buy these at uh, Menards and any other hardware store and uh, you see these are the specs for the panels if you're looking at checking it out or you want to buy something of this nature these are the specs Is a Kyocera uh, Kilo Charlie one two zero dash one. So this is how we do it. Just a fence post. We attach all the way down, and we have a support. These guys here, since just two of us putting this thing together, and uh, there's Tom right there. Tighten up the stuff, the U bolt, and this side is all done. This guy here is done, John? Uh, a little bit. So, we all this panel is going to be wired in series peril. Here's another one here, folks. Uh, that's the last two hanging there. You can see these are just fence posts. And uh, we got them inclined. You know, we have all concrete all the way down. And uh, you guys tell me if uh, we did a good job, beautiful job. And uh, give us a like and thumbs up. And Unistruts. This is how we do the thing. And that's the old array over there so now we have 10 panels 10 10 Kyocera's KC120-1 and we are ready to make power 1.2 kilowatt remember when we started it's just a 290 watt solar panel Tom can believe that was gonna make a change Indeed, it made a change. I convinced him, and finally, and uh, he saw exactly what solar can do. Okay, so folks, this is the system. It's just ten solar modules, the same voltage, the same manufacturer, the same model, everything, amps, everything. You know. 
for just a little guy like this can produce 10.7.10 um, amps at a VOC of 21.5 volts. This is what you want to do. If you want to have um, a battery backup system or just grid, um, it is good for grid tide too. Then you low, low voltage and higher amperage. So it's good for charging batteries. It has a lot of amp for just 120, 120 watts solar panels here. See that? that. The ISC, so you can go at a peak of 7.45 amps. That's the brand you want right here. Kyocera. Okay? Number one. All right, YouTube uh, friends, subscribers. This is what I have for you guys here. 10 solar. 10 Kyocera panels here and uh, 120 watt each so it's a 1.2 kilowatt is a upgrade update on my friends uh, um, off-grid system this is Tom grid off-grid and grid tied hybrid system 24 volt so He's off grid and grid tied once in a while when he's using a 240 because he doesn't have a 220. He doesn't have an inverter that is going to be doing a 220 or 240. So his stove takes 240. So all his laundry, washer, dryer, all TVs and refrigerator, everything comes from the battery. Okay. So this is what I'm doing today. Um, this is the part two of um, the uh, um, installing 10 Kyocera panels at Tom's house. And this is just to show you guys how the 10 panels are already installed and I'm cleaning the solar panels right now. Okay, here you see um, we have some kind of um, detergent. It's, a, it's a, 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 a liquid for car wash. If you're doing a car wash to your house, or your car wash at your house, you know, you don't have to go to the car wash place, you know. They have a certain uh, liquid that you can use to wash your car. It takes all the dirt and everything. So that's what I'm trying to show you guys here.